Honey has jumped out of a moving car in pursuit of a cat. I'm devastated. This is the, the joy of our lives. Gabriela's very worried that she could die. One way to see a dog that's apparently been driving along in the car with the window down, seen a cat and made a leap for it. Obviously he didn't get the cat, but landed pretty hard in the pavement, so I'm wide there now. Hello. Hi. I'm Donna. Hey, I'm Chris. Hi. How are you? It's Honey. It's Honey. As Chris arrives, 18-month-old Honey is crying out in severe pain. So that's the, that's the screaming. Yeah. yeah. She can't walk. We yeah. tried to bribe her with a treat. Yeah. And uh, it, it really hurt. So I think the pain is getting worse. I actually saw the cat and thought it may run across the road, so I slowed down. Must have been going at about 40. Just want to give her a few little pats and tell her it's going to be okay. It's going to be okay, honey. Ilana is blaming herself for Honey's accident. It's okay. Since they are only going on a short trip in the car, she didn't bother putting a harness on the spoodle. Honey puppy, it's all right. It's okay. Good girl. Yeah, it's okay. I'm devastated. This is the, the joy of our lives. And the kids absolutely adore her. Okay. It's very worried that she could die. Honey, okay. honey, honey. Okay. 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 When she's feeling the pain, it's when I'm actually running my fingers along her femur, yeah. along her main leg bone there. For Gabriella, seeing her 18-month-old puppy in pain is heartbreaking. She said to me, Dad, why aren't you crying? That's my best friend. She's been through a lot tonight already, and what I'm going to do in a second is give her an injection to make her feel a little bit less pain. I think everyone remembers their first pet. They mean absolutely everything to them, so to see them in pain, it's incredibly hard to watch. Chris now needs to take Honey to the clinic for x-rays. So who's going to sit up in the back here with her? Will the two of you go with... And the whole family is coming. This time, Honey is properly harnessed. So you're right there, guys? Yeah. To walk into a situation like that and see Gabby so upset, you want to tell her everything's okay? Everything's going to be fine. There's nothing wrong with her. But I can't say that just now. I don't know. Well, you've already cheated tonight. It's pretty brave, isn't it? How many dogs leap out of a car window like you did? The Spoodle's anxious family is waiting for the X-ray results. She hears a cat. While Honey is cat. unable to move on the X-ray table, out the back of the clinic, her arch enemies are still tormenting her. I'm here trying to decide whether Honey has a serious fracture, and she's thinking about felines. She hears one from out the back and all of a sudden, forget about the leg. If there's a cat there, I'll, I'll go it. I'm still good. I've got three good legs. I'll go. Just give me a chance. Fractures or felines? Which one is it? Jeez. Didn't expect that. Look, when you jump out of a car window at 40 k's an hour, you're going to expect some sort of injury there. What I can see on the x-ray though, suggests that she doesn't actually have too much. Resilient dog. Should we give her a family hug? <laughs> There's no fracture, thank God, but it is badly bruised. And I think it's a lesson to everybody. Even if it's late, late-ish and the roads are quiet, and even if you're going slowly, strap that dog in. Yes, rather safe than sorry. So I'm sorry, honey. It's the last thing I'll do to you. After an anti-inflammatory shot, okay. honey is ready to go home. There's some tablets as well, so one of those twice a day. Sorry, 
and the family can finally tell Chris about Mario, the reason Honey hates all cats. He's the black cat from next door who spends his day on the wooden fence uh, antagonising Honey. And this is the result. It suddenly makes sense. It's Mario's fault. Mario's been winding Honey up for the last 18 months. I'll see you later. Bye-bye. We're a very lucky family and she's an exceptionally lucky dog. So, Mario, if you're watching, check that fence. Check it twice. Let's get the impression someone's coming to get you. Don't forget the seatbelt. Hello. How are you? Hi, hi, how are you doing? She, she chases balls as well as cats? Absolutely. She looks great. <laughs> Honey, the cat-hating spoodle, is showing no battle scars after jumping from a moving car. It's fantastic to see Honey looking so well, but while I'm here, I just have to see the object of her obsession, Mario. Honey, leave Mario alone. Finally, the much maligned Mario makes an appearance. Honey, honey. The way Hunter reacts and the way Mario's talked about, I expected more much bigger. This. What I got was was this. I bet it's Mario's a lot more powerful than this. It's all, it's all in here, isn't it? <laughs> it's clear the war between Honey and Mario is not going to end anytime soon. <laughs> Now that I've seen Mario, he's old, he's small, he's shy, he runs away. The only conclusion you can draw is that Honey probably needs to chill out. In this relationship, Honey needs to be sweeter. If you guys loved that video, great. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel below. That way. That way. <laughs>